introduce it again? Yeah, this is our song that we wrote called To Country for Nashville. Hi, I'm Joel. I'm Leanne. And we're To Country for Nashville. And that's because we like to play real traditional country music. We like to bring back all the, those good artists that you remember and, and try to keep that feel in our own music too, our new music that we write. We decided to try out for a, uh, one of these reality uh, talent shows on uh, CMT, the Can You Duet show. And uh, we finally got to the actual judges for the show and uh, sang for them. They, they loved it. Said, man, y'all sing that stuff great, but uh, unfortunately it's too country for, for the show. So we left and we walked away disappointed. And Joel said, well, you know, we at least so came at up least with our name out of it. <laughs> Nothing else we got a name out of it. Yeah, so, so we became too country for Nashville. We play around, uh, mostly around the Franklin area and over in Murfreesboro, uh, Tennessee area. We don't fit the Nashville mold of today at all. We're playing real country music for people that remember country music the way it, it used to be. That's we recorded cool in a place up in uh, Hendersonville, Tennessee, called Fry Pharmacy, and it, it was it's all analog, so it's like it, it's old style recording. It was 20, 24 track, two inch tape. But you know, it's it's real music. It's live music. It's it's we sound we. We wanted it to sound like us when you come to hear us at a show. So the CD, I mean, that's yeah. that's what you get and when you come here. And if you buy a CD at the show and you go pop it in your car on the way home, you're like, that's exactly, yeah, that's that's, what, that's I heard. what I heard. We're, so we're, we're selling a CD while we're here. here right, get it. Cool. Sure, I got it right. That was the most exciting thing, was opening oh, yeah. that box and pulling out that first CD. So back in the spring, we had a, a big, huge CD release party. We had it at our friend's house called The Country Club. It's, it's amazing. Yeah. It's the best, best drug, best medicine in the world. <laughs> it's just playing on stage. I, I just knew he needed to be singing. He was driving a truck for several years, and, and he just, that, this is his passion. And I said, we need to do whatever we can. It's the only to job I ever had. Sing. It's the only job I ever had. I don't want to quit. <laughs> <laughs> this is the music. Yeah. But uh. And so he said, he said, you know, can we do that? And I said, we uh, we need to at least try. And I knew she sang, so because she used to sing in like gospel quartets and stuff, and, and we'd sing together at the house. So I said, well, you need to do this with me because I'm all about harmony, harmony singing anyway. Yeah. And there's all these country duets that nobody was doing, so. I started teaching her those, and we just took off yeah. from there. And people loved it. And we just kept getting bigger and bigger until it's what it is now. And yeah, and it, we just love it. It's a lot of fun. That we I think you're too goddamn country for Nashville. And it is. It's the only job I ever had that it doesn't feel like a job. It's like I, I want to go do it. Doesn't matter how tired I am, I want to go play a show. You know. Yeah. I, I just love it. I just love Absolute it. Absolutely. If passion. people can find, you know, what makes them happy, and actually figure out a way to make it a, a living at it, that's the most beautiful thing in the world. <laughs> you know. So that's, I encourage everybody to do it. Aww. I'm proud of you. <laughs> I'm proud of you. Yeah. Ah, thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. It's fun. Yeah, love it. I'm having a blast. <laughs>